Uh, hey everybody, Jerome and Ashley here from Atmosphere Collectibles, and we have our new releases and restocks video for the first week in March. <laughs> first full week in March. Mm -hmm. So we have uh, some really great restocks and uh, some big new releases. Yeah, in no particular order, I guess, what we should say. Yeah. Um, okay, so... The first one was a special order, although I may be able to get it back in. And uh, this is a Music on Vinyl limited edition of 1,000 numbered copies on flaming colored vinyl. It is a 3LP, and the group is The Gentle Storm, and the album <coughs> is called The Diary. And um, it's this has got both the gentle versions of the songs and then the same songs, the storm versions all spread on three LPs. If you're not familiar with this group, I, to me, they give the vibe of like Lorena McKinnon or kind of like Celtic kind of beautiful, beautiful music. I don't know. So this, hopefully this uh, music on vinyl import uh, will be a great sounding version. So this is a big one. This is um, Miley Cyrus, um, Endless Summer Vacation. And this is her new one. And this is the indie exclusive, which I believe comes with a poster. I don't, they didn't give us a lot of information on this one, so we'll have to wait and see. I presume it's black, because it doesn't say. It does not say. But we'll see. So, but that's going to be a big one. Uh, okay, so this is another music on vinyl title. It was also a special order. It's limited edition of 1,500 numbered copies on translucent blue colored vinyl. And it is Anderson, Bruford, Wakeman, and Howe. And uh, it's featuring Brother of Mine, Order of the Universe, and Let's Pretend with Vangelis. So, yeah, that's uh, going to be a big one. Uh, mm -hmm. Bush has a new one, The Artist Revival. And this one is on white vinyl and comes with a 32-page booklet. I'm excited to hear what that sounds like. Yeah, I haven't heard anything from them in a while. so Sort of out of touch. I am, anyway. Uh, okay, so this was a special order, uh, although it comes out today and I can get more of these in. Um, and it is The Best of Richard Cheese, The Sunny Side of the Moon. It's the first time on record on yellow vinyl. And I love that cover art. And he does, I guess this group does like lounge act versions of popular <coughs> songs. So anywhere from Nirvana to Slipknot to Sir Mix-a-Lot. Motley Crue, The Clash, Beastie Boys, Van Halen, Snoop Dogg, The Offspring, Radiohead. Basically stuff you would not think would be done by a lounge yeah. act. So, so definitely check it out. And if you want me to get more of these in, let me know. So like I said, we had some bigger restocks and uh, System of a Down, Toxicity. I know we've got people waiting on this one. So, Well, another restock that I have a limited amount and I have... Really excited to see this one come back in stock. And I, I Gillette, if you need this, grab it now while you can because it was reissued a couple years ago and it's been out of stock basically ever since. And it's Allison Chain's facelift reissue. You definitely want to let us know if you need a copy because I know people oh, were paying crazy prices. Yeah, for those. and it'll go really fast. So, so. Um, you know, hopefully I can get rid of Take care of all my locals. Also, the uh, two album version of Audio Slave, Audio Slave, back in stock. So those are ones that we haven't had for a while. We're happy to have back in. Mm. So. so we've got another music on vinyl release. This is 90s Movie Hits Collected. It's a limited edition of 2,000 numbered copies. One is on translucent green <coughs> and one is translucent yellow vinyl and it's Featuring classic movie themes by U2, R.E.M., Tina Turner, John Bon Jovi, Roxette, UB40, Jamiroquai, Whitney Houston, Seal, The Cardigans, Lenny Kravitz, and more. Um, so really interesting, um, you know, tracks on this one. And uh, I think that'll be pretty So we've popular. got another uh, restock uh, from The Fires, Greta Van Fleet, which is another one. That it comes and goes. So, all right. Uh, this is one by a local group, or a group local to us. It's the new album from the Cold Stairs, 
and it's called Voices. Uh, this is limited edition on burgundy plum vinyl, and it says Fuzzed Up Heavy Blues and Rock and Roll. They used to be a two-piece. Uh, this is their first full length with the three, third member that they recently added not that long ago. So really excited for the cold stairs. All right, so they're doing the uh, diabolic stuff finally. Uh, infinity through purification, and this is on uh, flaming orange vinyl and diabolic Florida death metal. Uh, I don't think this has ever had a vinyl release, or if it has, uh, I've never seen it. So drums definitely keeping one of those. Yeah. There's stuff. a few things drums keeping this week. Uh, okay, so this is the most recent album from the group Alves, and it's called Blue Rev. And uh, I believe this came out last fall, and um, I ran out of them, and I had a special request for it. Let me know if you'd like. I can get more of these in. All right. Uh, Antichrist Demon Core, Satan is King, some hardcore, uh, power violence, if you like fast core, uh, Almost grindcore, really good stuff. So, mm. okay, so this is a Friday music reissue of Queen's Reich's album Empire. Uh, it is a two LP, and um, well, I just say that Friday music are a little pricier titles, and with this being they a two LP. Pricey. It does, it's going to sting a little bit, but it is an iconic album, and at the moment, I can't get any other version in, uh, so I'm just happy to have any version of it in. We got some Pussifer. We've got uh, Bro Violator, and this one is on clear vinyl. And then we've also got Money Shot. Now, this one is on black vinyl. And we have uh, V is for Versatile, and this is limited edition clear vinyl. So, quite a bit of post for going out today. All right. So, I've got some Blue Note here. We've got uh, the a new Blue, Blue Note classic. And this is uh, Hor Horace Parlin Quintet, Speak in My Peace. And it also has <coughs> Stanley Turrentine, Tommy Turrentine, George Tucker, and Al Harwood. And I think I'm contractually obliged to say that it's a uh, master from the original analog tapes by Kevin Gray. <laughs> and then also we've got the tone blue note tone poet series, and it is Donald bird at the half note cafe with pepper Adams, Duke Pearson, uh, and more jazz at the waterfront. Nice. And, yeah. Uh, remember you must die suicide silence, 180 gram black eyes vinyl. This is uh, with the new singer, I believe. So. so this is a new 20th anniversary reissue of Thrice's album, The Illusion of Safety. And I presume that this is on colored vinyl, uh, but I, I, is this Blue Twister, maybe? Uh, but yeah, let me know if you need one of those. All right, let's see. We got some subhumans. We got uh, The Day the Country Died and EPLP. They're redoing the subhumans. These are the two we got to start with. Uh, classic classic hardcore, yeah. And they're super affordable, so, so let me know if you want one. Uh, I'm super excited. I've already opened one of these and played it in the shop yesterday. The reissue of Cake Prolonging the Magic. Uh, this is featuring Never There, Let Me Go, and Sheep Go to Heaven. It says remastered audio on, this is black vinyl. Um, you know, I was so excited when they did Fashion Nugget, and then I was really like, oh, I, that's the main one I need. But then after really uh, playing this, I'm is. like, oh, I'm so glad they did this one. So if you'd like a copy of this, let me know. I did have a few people pre-order it from me as well, but... Um, this is awesome. <laughs> so we have a couple of the Sabaton uh, rearmed. We have uh, uh, Terio Dominatrix rearmed. I don't know. Uh, and this one's called Prime Victoria rearmed. Victoria, yeah. 
and both of these are black vinyl, two LPs. So it's been really hard for us to get Sabaton and stuff in. We like have a few locals that are really into them too. So, um, okay, so this is a new release. It's Matt Anderson and the Big Bottle of Joy. Uh, this is a two LP, and I believe that that he's from Australia. I could be wrong on that. And it's kind of that soul blues rock kind of vibe. Uh, really like what I heard. I pulled it up and sampled a little bit of it. And I was like, because I'm a real big fan of the Teskey Brothers. And it's super excited that they have a new album coming out. So, um, yeah, check it out. This is uh, Lynch Mob, uh, Rebel. This is on um, Red Marbled Vinyl. And it's with the alternate cover, which is uh, a little bit better of a cover, I feel like. <laughs> All right, so we've got some more jazz. Now, this is a Light in the Attic exclusive. I think it's yellow vinyl, and it's Chet Baker, Sextet, and Quartet. And, um, yeah. So, yeah, it is a limited edition Light in the Attic pressing. And uh, I do know a lot of our local, a lot of the young people coming in uh, to jazz, they're always asking for Chet, Chet Baker. Baker yeah. so. so this is another new one. This is Iggy and the Stooges, Raw Power Live. And uh, this is one of the reunion shows in the hands of the fans. Mm -hmm. So it's almost impossible to find older versions, older Stooges concerts that sound good, that just don't exist. Even Metallic KO, the sound quality is terrible. So it's nice to, uh, to have this. Okay, so this is a group that I like. I'm not that great at explaining them, but I will try my best. This is a uh, group called the Sleepford Mods, and the album is called UK Grim. So this is their most recent album. It's on limited edition silver vinyl, and they are like a British duo that is kind of like, uh, it's got a punky vibe, but they're kind of electronic, kind of got like spoken word. If you're a fan of Viagra Boys, you probably like them as well. If you're a fan of uh, even the Fontaines DC, I could see how you could like that. They have really thick, uh, like Bristol accents, and um, they're just really uh, interesting. Just check them out if you like. Billy Strings home. Back in style. All right. So I have a couple of Mac Miller reissues. So we have uh, Best Day Ever, and then we also have Circles, both of these back in stock. Um, I will be, I've got a lot of locals, they're going after all the Mac Miller, and since it's, it's like kind of Taylor Swift, how it's so popular, it's all out of stock um, most right. of the times, but as they become available, I start, you know, We also in. still have some Mac Miller on cassette tape, so. Oh, I think I ran out. Oh, did you? Yeah. Well, well, well I guess we no longer have Well, Mac I can, Miller I think there's a few tape. I can still get. Uh, Deftones, Diamond Eyes, this is one that's been out for a while. Yep. Just like with all the Deftones, it's like. All of them are out of stock except for one or two, and then those go out of stock and the other ones pop up. It's a whack-a-mole. All right, so we've got Aesop Rock Bazooka Tooth, and it just is a pressed on 2LP featuring the tracks No Jumper Cables, Freeze, and The Greatest Pac-Man Victory in History. I like the cover art, it's super cool. Uh, Black Purple Haze Vinyl, this is Circle of Snakes, uh, Danzig. All right, so I have a the Daniel Johnston's Songs of Pain uh, debut album, first time on vinyl. Now it says 1980 to 1981, vulnerable and brilliant. Uh, if you're a fan of Daniel Johnston, then you're you know then you're already familiar with his catalog. I believe this is just like super early and. Um, pretty cool that it's a 2LP and it's pretty cool that they are uh, you know re reissuing yeah. Daniel Johnston so uh, I've got some Post Malone I've got Stoney and Beer Bongs and Bentleys yes, that's the name of this one <laughs> I had to read it hmm uh, I had last week, I, somebody had missed out on the used copy of Silvers and Pickups Better Nature. So, but luckily I was able to get another copy in for them. So that one is claimed, but um, 
these are still in stock, so I can't get more of those. All right, I've got uh, Slipknot, the gray chapter, back in stock. On pink vinyl. I will say back in stock. However, when those were first reissued, we were severely shorted. Like, we yeah, didn't get, we uh, they got allocated, and so uh, a lot of people probably by now had just, like, went out and found a copy because they, but now I've got them. So let me know if you still need one. If you need it, we have it. Yeah. All right. So we've got a uh, restock of Soundgarden, um, Super Unknown, 2LP. Super excited about Great this record. one. Iconic album. All right. Afghan Wigs, How Do You Burn? Uh, the great record. They, uh, everything they've ever done, I think, is pretty but this is definitely worth checking out. It's their last one, Afghan Wigs. Uh, all right, so this is a original motion picture soundtrack of Superbad, and uh, it's super fun soundtrack. Love that movie. Oh my, it's so funny. And it's the, on the soundtrack, you've got anywhere from the Bar Kays, Curtis Mayfield, Rick James, and um, also lots of you know clips from the movies in between tracks. Um, so that's a super fun one. I'm just happy with that. So we've got some uh, Bikini Kill back in stock. We've got uh, Reject All American. And Revolution Girl Style Now. So this is demo tape 1991 with three previously unreleased tracks. So we just really like Bikini Kill, so we're happy to get those in. Uh, back in stock, we got Coulter Wall, Imaginary Appalachia. Um, yeah, it's, I just can't keep Filter Wall in stock. I mean, literally uh, every week, I've been, now that they're in stock, I've been trying to ship them out every week. Night Ranger, we uh, got into Night Ranger not too long ago, and it all sold yep. faster than I could have ever guessed. Yeah, I had like um, three people who wanted this one and only yeah. one copy, so luckily I just, so I went ahead and grabbed another copy. So Midnight Madness, I think this is, uh, original label art, 12 inch LP, limited to a thousand copies, opaque blue, um, yeah. one pressing. So, Night Ranger. All right. Oh, I don't know if I showed this one yet. Uh, did I show? So, the Lil Yachty album, uh, Let's Start This, or what is it? Oh, Let's Start Here That's by Yachty. It's been a big deal. Yeah. There's nothing like what you think it's going to sound like. Well, I know that like uh, since it's been out, it's been mostly out of stock. But every, every couple of weeks, like every week or so, I might get a couple copies. So I think this week I've got enough to cover the people that's been waiting for a copy. And then I'll have uh, and one copy. So extra. let us know if you need a copy because yeah. we'll have one hidden floor. But if it sells before you get a chance, we'll make sure you get one next week. Yeah. Uh, Sansui Bog or Sansuzi Bog, however you say their name, uh, everybody knows who they are. Uh, Tortured Hole. So this one's called Homicidal Ecstasy. Uh, we this is their this most one recent is black one. Vinyl. And this one it says. Uh, Limited transparent Coke bottle clear vinyl includes a wild and very detailed art booklet. Uh, very with like three E's. So Yeah, they uh, have some really crazy art. Yeah. They so do. Uh, definitely <laughs> worth checking out if you like death metal. It's kind of got a uh, pace of its own. But All right. Interesting. So um, as Smashing Pumpkin stuff comes in and out of stock, I always have them all on back order, and then I usually have a list uh, that I'm working on of who needs what. So I've got one copy of a door, and my friend John needs this one. He's the next on the list, so this will be his. But believe me, as soon as I can get more in, I will. So let me know which ones that you need, and as they become available, I'm working on my list. We got Melodrama by Lord, and we also have Pure Heroin. Yeah. We love Lord. So. All right. So last week I got in some copies of our Fallout Boy from Under the Cork Tree. And I had more people want it than more copies that I had gotten. So this week I've got the extra <coughs> copies that I needed. And I think I'll have one hitting the floor. Uh, let me know if you need this. I've got 
I'll have a few more copies coming in next week too. We got one of these in last week and it sold right off the bat. Uh, Gateways of Annihilation, Morbid Angel, Steve Tucker era, great stuff. Alright, we've got like 15 minutes, but uh, all right, so we've got Unwound. Uh, this is a reissue. It's on Rising Blood Vinyl. I believe this is a special order. And you want to go let her know? Uh, and uh, But I can get some more of these in. Uh, we've got a restock of Kate Bush, Hounds of Love. All right, we have uh, Rip to Shreds, uh, Jubileum. If you like uh, death metal, this is a fantastic album. It's one that uh, I couldn't get on vinyl, so I finally got the CD, and it took me a while to get the CD. I got it last week. Finally, the vinyl came in, so. Drove's keeping one, he's super excited. He's yeah, got one to listen great, in the car, great record. and one for a while. Probably not open at the store. <laughs> uh, so we're back in stock. We got Lord Huron, Strange Trails. Post Dramatic, I Prevail. And this is, uh, this is it's four bonus live. tracks. Uh, I don't know. I guess it's black. Mm. So. All right. So this is a Kendra Morris reissue of Babel. And it is limited to 1,200 copies on uh, gold colored gold swirl vinyl, and it we are big fans of Kendra Morris. This is one of her earlier self-released albums, and then it also includes some bonus tracks. We've been playing so, it quite a bit. It's yeah, good record. Uh, Karloff, uh, Raw Nights, and this is uh, I believe their newest. Um, yeah. Uh, back in stock, we got Kanye West, My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy, a uh, 3LP set with nice art prints. Um, try to keep those in stock as long as I'm able to. Uh, LDR and FR, Lana Del Rey. So, <laughs> yeah, back in stock. Uh, so I had a special order for Leon Bridges' most recent album called Do Gold Digger Sound. Uh, really great. Great voice on Leon Bridges. Uh, the Lost Boys, they did this not too long ago. We couldn't keep them in, so yeah. The it's Lost a Friday Boys. music reissue. Uh, this, I believe, is a special order. I think it was something I had a back order. Um, and I believe it's jazz, just from the person who requested it. Dijon, Dijonette, Grenadier, Medeski, Schofield, and it's called Hudson. I believe that's jazz. I don't know. Uh, Ampupuncture, Mars Volta. Oh, did you want to show your boxes? I did. Uh, oh. Go ahead. All right, so we've got uh, Rodriguez reissue and... of Cold Flat, Cold Fact. Uh, we love this album. Um, if you haven't seen the documentary Searching for Sugar Man, I highly recommend it. It's so good, and um, just a great album. I believe that. We have like a light in the attic pressing, uh, personally, but I think that one's out of print. But either way, I'm just happy to, that I'm able to get it in because it's such an iconic album. So we have this Immortal Coil, which is basically uh, a 3LP coil box set. And, um, and then we also have a 2LP. So it's called This Immortal Coil, The World Ended a Long Time Ago. And Jerome is a big fan of the group Coil, and uh, it's got... So it looks like the box contains the record, the record <laughs> plus an additional record. It is and numbered. Additional two records, it looks like. Yeah. So this one's called The Dark Ages of Love, and then that one's called what? Um... Okay, Twisted so, by Love. So it's a 5LP box set. So it has the Dark Ages, the Dark Age of Love, The World Ended a Long Time Ago, which is here, and then the Twisted by Love. And I didn't know it was coming out, and I'm not sure if this is remixes 
or what it is actually when I saw it in the distro I thought it was this Mortal Coil the band it's also like uh, the 4AD band but it's a uh, coil set with uh, four or three albums that are remixed or maybe redone completely I'm not sure but uh, anyway Drum uh, will find out what it is I yeah. mean because you know yeah. He went and all in with the box set. But. There was no information, news, or as far as press release that I know of on that. Yeah. But either way, uh, Drum likes the band Coil. So if you like like atmospheric, dark, kind of electronic, dark, uh, um, ambient almost sometimes, it's an interesting band. Yeah, so. it's uh, early industrial. Um, but yeah, that's it for today. Uh, we have a used video coming up, and it is going to be a long one, so uh, get ready for it, I guess. We'll I get know. as many uh, records pre uh, priced up that we can. And uh, uh, Thanks for watching, and... Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend. Thanks for subscribing. All of that jazz. Have a great day. <laughs> Bye.